Hello everyone, Ross McDermott here. Uh, now, a practice that I do a lot for my own technique and also uh, something I show my students quite a lot is learning how to swing the club with one hand. Um, now this is a practice I did with my pro Richard many, many years ago and it's something I still do and I uh, find it has a great deal of benefits to uh, help you get better swing technique. So, how you normally set up with this one, I've got an iron iron here, keep everything exactly the same as I would for an iron iron, drop my left hand off the grip, just let it hang under my shoulder and then rotate my shoulders on the backswing. You can see my right elbow stayed flexed here, and that's really important. It's not a practice that you just swing your arm back and forward and hope to make contact with the ball. Make everything normally as you would for a setup. Drop your left hand off, and make sure that your shoulders start the backswing. You rotate your shoulders back, and then as you swing forward, you just let your whole body rotate back to your target. Okay, so same setup position. Drop your left hand off, rotate your shoulders back and then swing forward and the same when you do your left hand normal setup position take your right hand off just let it hang lightly under your shoulder and make sure that you're turning your shoulders in this direction you turn back and then you swing out okay so this is a great practice especially for the left hand if you're right-handed golfer a lot of golfers tend to pull the arms in at impact but the more you practice this you learn actually that motion of swinging your arms out wide on your forward swing. So it's a great practice if you tend to do that with your golf swing or you tend to swing from out to in. So set up as normal, drop your left hand off, turn your shoulders back, making sure your right arm is staying flexed, and then you rotate your whole body back to your target. Your arm will follow. And you'd be surprised with a little bit of practice, even just with a, a nine iron or a seven iron, tee the balls up a little bit, how actually far you can hit a ball just with one hand. It's not a distance test though. Your, your target really is to, as I'll show you in a few minutes from both sides with the camera, I'll do some demo shots for you. Your target really is not to hit the ball a long way. Your target is to hit as many balls as you can straight from the sweet spot and hit them absolutely straight ahead.
Okay, so I hope that demonstration has shown you just how simple this practice can be. Uh, as I said, I've done this with the nine iron. I've teed up every every ball around about a centimeter or so, so give myself a little bit of help. The more you practice it, though, you'll be surprised how how cleanly and how well you can hit a ball from the grass just uh, uh, with a nine iron or seven iron. And if it's going well, well take a hybrid out and try that as well but again it's not a distance test you have to make sure and that I can't iterate enough on basically on this uh, practice you have to let the shoulders do the work you rotate your shoulders back you rotate forward as well and you'd be surprised with a little bit of practice just how cleanly you can hit every shot absolutely straight ahead um, so uh, subscribe to the channel uh, more videos coming soon and uh, thanks very much and bye bye